T minus 20 seconds. T minus 15 seconds and counting. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We have ignition and we have liftoff of NASA's Mars Climate Orbiter as we continue to explore the mysteries of the Red Planet. A view from the second stage of the Boeing Delta II vehicle as we continue to rise 20 seconds after liftoff. Everything continues to go well. Everything continues to look good as the Delta vehicle climbs away from the Earth with the Mars Climate Orbiter payload on board. Beginning their slow decline. Again, real-time telemetry details are being called out by Eric Anderson from the telemetry lab. We have passed through Mach 1 coming up on max Q. We see our normal latitude disturbances. Guidance controlling nicely. Main engine, both burners continue to burn well. We expect to see these boosters burn out and jettison at about 64 seconds after launch, coming up in about 10 all seconds. Solids beginning to tail off now. And we have burnout on all solids. Solids are tailing off at this time. And we have jettison of the solids. And good separation on all four solids. Good separation on all four solids as reported. Main engine, both burners continue to burn well. Attitude disturbances at separation nominal. Guidance controlling nicely. Again, a beautiful view from the second stage of the Delta vehicle as it continues to rise now, one minute, 39 seconds after liftoff. The next event will occur when the main engine cutoff occurs at about... Main engine, both burners continue to burn well. Vehicle now at an altitude of 21.5 nautical miles, downrange distance 45 nautical miles, velocity over 3,000 miles per hour. A wonderful view of the Earth's limb as we rise above the Earth's surface with our Mars Climate Orbiter and the fairing of this Delta vehicle. Two minutes, 15 seconds after launch. Everything continues to look good. First stage continues to burn very well. Flight pass right at the uh, nominal predix. We're at launch plus vehicle, two minutes, 45 vehicle seconds. Vehicle now in an altitude of 34 nautical miles, downrange distance 90 nautical miles, velocity over 4,800 miles per hour. Guidance continues to control nicely. Booster can maintaining a very nominal flight path. All pressures and currents remain stable. Again, everything continues to go well with launch of our Delta rocket and the Mars Climate Orbiter. <coughs> the orbiter is expected to reach Mars in September of 1999. Still about 30 seconds away from a nominal MECO, altitude 49 nautical miles, downrange distance 198 nautical miles, velocity over 9,000 miles per hour. Real-time calls, of course, coming in through the telemetry lab as Eric Anderson looks at the real-time data as it is arriving from the vehicle. Coming up in the next 10 seconds for main engine cutoff. We have float switches, fuel and locks. Miko is in. And we have main Miko, engine cut off. main engine has cut off. Vernier is still burning. Vernier, Vico, Verniers have cut off. 